mail through here and today we got some mail and it's a special mail video we got a package from james a massive flat rate box from james here once again let's get right into it okay i got the note out looks like there's a lot of stuff in here we've got some e tins but let's see what the note says this time around hey ziri here's my latest package it's a bit of a hodgepodge of stuff there is some non-hockey stuff as well as the usual grant fear cards by now you must have one of the best grant fear collections out there the last package i sent you german cards so this time the gpk tins are full of awesome Austrian hockey cards. He's referring to the garbage pail kids tins here. There's two of these, but of course there are tons of goalies to add to your collection, including another sign of the times. I was also going through my cards and found more cards from when I was a kid. I really do miss the junk wax era. Back then it was fun to collect just for your favorite players. Today has become all about the big hits, and I think that has hurt the hobby, especially for kids. <laughs> yeah. I remember when you could get cards from gas stations, cereal boxes, peanut butter, chips, and even Zellers had cards. Now it costs a fortune to buy cards. Cards. I think the lack of competition has really hurt the hub. Well, enough ranting from me. I hope you enjoy the cards. Keep up the great work. James. So, James, we'll see what you said. Yes, I definitely agree with you there. I know I am a hit junkie myself, but some very solid points there. So, let's see what you said. We'll start off with those Austrian hockey cards, which are in here. So, let's get those open. Okay, first one here. We got two of these. Take these cards out. Big package from James here. All right. Well, first off here. So, I guess these are the Austrian cards. We got Sebastian Dom there. 15, 16. I mean, if you look at these at a glance, they could probably pass for 30 years ago, but they're fairly recent cards there. Sebastian Dom there, so City Press. Looks like these are made by, but we got a bunch of goalies here. Mike Murphy, so I don't know if any of these guys came even close to the NHL. Oh, Andy Chiodo did, I'm pretty sure. Pittsburgh, I'd like to say there. That rings a bell there. Olivier Watt, there's that. There's Fabian Winehandle, so a bunch of goalies from the Austrian League here. Okay, I don't know where the heck James got these, but okay, there's Chiodo again, Wine Handle again, so Adam Monroe, semi rings a bell. Hey, Danny Sabrin, fairly familiar name there, and Adam Monroe again. Uh, continuing on here, more goalies. Oh, that's a rookie there. Olberg there. Okay, uh, yep, just a bunch of goalies. Probably every goalie that played in Austria the past decade or so. There's Stark Bomb there, 2010, 2011 there. It looks like these are 2010, 2011 cards here. Here, any recognizable names? Not really. You got 11, 12 cards here. Okay, more Adam Monroe. Oh, Matt Zaba. Semi rings a bell also there. Oh, what the heck is this? Authentic game worn jersey of Benjamin Petrick there. It says Bank something Liga there. There's an advertising piece there. That's interesting there. Oh, only the 29. Worn during the 16th, 17th season. Oh, and then we have some autograph cards here. We got Danny Boyd. That rings a bell somewhat there. 2013 authentic signatures there. Looks like it's on card there. That's interesting there. Huh. And then final card here we got Olivier Latendresse. Is that Guillaume's brother perhaps there? But 13, 14 signatures. Has like a clear cut lightning bolt there. Or maybe that's just a die cut there. Huh. Interesting. Very cool there. Huh. Okay. Next one up here. And yes, this is definitely foreign to me. I am quite unfamiliar with these cards here. But some DEL cards. Andre there. Andrew Werner there. I'm guessing this is more early 2000s. And these are made by Upper Deck. So wow. Dang. 2001 there. A few of those cards there. Okay. Is this like now? National team cards here from 96. They're Burton K. Uh, okay. All right. Then we got the Champions Trophy there. Okay. Luca there. We got some like mini card stickers here of Luca there and also Luca. K. Okay. There's Luca again. What year is this? 13, 14 perhaps there. So there you go. More Luca. A lot of Luca here. Geez. Oh, even more. Oh, Global Great. K. Okay. There's Pekka there. So very unfamiliar with these. I do apologize for that. But there's Merrick Schwartz. That kind of sounds familiar. Saint Louis, maybe, but there you go. There's Duba, homegrown Thomas there, or Thomas there, DV there. There's Chiodo again, player of the month, JP Lamaru, okay, and a few more cards there. Yeah, I don't know. And then we have a couple more cards here, okay. So there are those. I'll definitely put those with the German cards there. Definitely unfamiliar with those. Also, we have this in the package here. We got Tops Match Attack Emerald Mini Tin, four amazing mini tins to collect. Actually, I think this might be a good thing to have as like bonus content. So this will be something I'll open at the end of a random video like i did with some contenders basketball recently so, so i'll do that with this and let's just grab a tea tin here from the package from james and see what's in store here okay well very well protected let's see what's in the first tin here i'm anticipating plenty of grant fear in here all right starting off here we got a grant fear pro set there on the oilers there oh that's cool mass men from leaf there 2018 leaf oh grant fear it's a chrome rookie there is that from uh tops chrome like 98 i think thought about opening a box of that to try to hunt the 
the Gretzky Refractor rookie in there, but that's cool there. Yeah, this looks to be all Grant Fear G's leader there. We got SB Authentic base there. Foily SBA base there. That's from 97, 98. So first year SBA. That's a nice looking base design. Very different from current year though. We got some Pacific Revolution there. Interesting looking card there. Oh, that's cool. Pinnacle certified, certified red there. Don't see any numbering there, but really cool there. We got Donruss Priority. Him on the Sabres there. Just a bunch of 90s Grant Fear stuff here. We got some score there, like 95, 96, if I were to guess there. 96, 97, I think there. Okay, clear 96, 97 there. Some Stadium Club. We got some score. So yeah, just a bunch of Grant Fuhrers here. Oh, there's Select. Some old Select there. Donruss. I would say the mid to late 90s had some of the coolest inserts here. You have to be, right? Like, I mean, a lot of them are really popular and highly sought after today, but really nice stuff there. We got a Grant Fuhrer pot. That's really cool there. All right, let's continue on here. We got some Donruss Studio Grant Fuhrer there. Then we got Playoffs Parkhurst there. Like an 86 Grant Fuhrer there, I'm pretty sure. Same year as Lemieux's rookie. 85, 86. Okay. I got a little sticker there, Fuhrer. Got some Invincible Fuhrer. Like, look at this. Stacking the pads grant fear there pinnacle uh, more recent stuff there tim hortons team canna fear leaf fear great outdoors fear i like the old timers game there or something uh, that one's the 500 op chi the retro there or op chi marquee legends fear op chi premier the stuff i've never opened and want to open there the 75 oh we got some platinum 15 16 him on the leafs there that's the retro gold to 149 right yeah gold rainbow to 149 oh got a blue cubes also 15 16 that is 35 dang that's pretty low numbered i guess it's because because he's a legend there. There you go, NHL legend. That's really cool there. Oh my gosh. Dynasty Kings, Grant Fuhrer. What the heck is that from? It's from Leaf there. Interesting design there. Dynasty King. Private signings. Grant Fuhrer, dang. Really nice one there. Private signings are really nice. Oh, we got some more Panini stuff here. Dominion, another box I need to open there, but there's Fuhrer on card auto. Retired 2000 there. It's like a ruby there. 17 to 50. Oh, we got a stamp autograph there. Dang, James. So there you go. There's Fuhrer. That's really cool there. We got a shadow box from like 12, 13 SP. 1314 SPX there, Shadow Box of Fear. Oh, Ice Scripts there from like late 2000 there, 708 Trilogy. And to finish things off, we have a couple of cards here. We got Signature Saves to 100 there. Basically like a ringside signings, but from Sweet Shot there, a Fear there. And oh, look at this. Old Ink. You got Fear on the top, you got Ron Hextall on the bottom from Team Canada Master Collection. That stuff is not cheap, but really nice cards in there. And this is no exception. Look at the gold ink on there. Dang. But there you go. Wow. That's just the first thing. Also, there's two big padded envelopes in here. I'm just gonna open one right now and see what it is. Well, it's a binder. Humpty Dumpty binder. Star Cards Collector album there. And then what the heck is this? Uh, you've received an exclusive Game War jersey card of Benjamin something. K? That is bizarre. That's related to the Austrian cards there. K? Oh, wow. Look at this. Bunch of Humpty Dumpty mini cards. Oh, that's really cool there. There's Fear, of course. Kirk McLean. Wendell Clark there. Ah, oh, that's really cool there. Shanahan. Early 90s, right? Yeah. There's Sackick. Patrick Wow, very cool there. This must be the complete set. It has to be, right? There's Bill Ranford. Wow, really cool there. Dogger. Actually, I can just see the year right there. 92. More player there is Trevor Linden there. Phil Helsley. Wow, that's really cool right there. All right, I don't know what the heck's on my hand, but let's continue opening up these tins from James here. And I know in a recent video I showed my collection's kind of gotten out of hand. Well, I've made pretty good strides in sorting stuff as of late. Then again, I still need work on sorting by individual player, but my current situation is much better than it was a couple months ago. But there is that. That. Let's check out whatever the heck is in here. What am I looking at here? Oh, we got another little binder here. This time it's from Highliner. Okay. Greatest goalies. Oh, look at that. Okay, so that's where that Grant Fear card we saw earlier was from. From Highliner. But yeah, you get cards from everywhere. And Highliner is one of them there. That's so bizarre. Looking back nowadays. But of course, Upper Deck has a Monopoly now. But there you go. There's all the goalies there. Bernie Perron. So I guess it goes through the years there. Tony Esposito. Johnny Bauer. That's really cool there. Oh, Terry Sawchuk. So. Bill Durant. It, wow, really goes through the years. 1947, 48. Felix Potvin, rookie year, 92, 93. Evolution of the mask. Oh, that's really cool there. 1925, that's barely a mask. Approximately 1960. Jacques Plant, right? And then you got the 70s. 1990 there with the North Stars mask. That's really cool there. Oh, you got the Vezina trophy. Wow, really cool little binder there. <laughs> okay, more cards from James here. Eddie Belfort still on the Blackhawks there. Fleer 95. Crazy design on the back there. Oh, you got a Bill Ramford. You got Trevor Kidd. Fleer 95 
as well. All of these are from Fleer95 there. Mark Messier, really colorful, very 90s. There's a Joe Sackick. Okay, then we got a Cujo. Then we got Jeff Cortnell. Gino Ogic. So these are all from like the same set there. We got Cliff Running. Oh, Platinum Club of Gino Ogic there from Collector's Choice. Got a Heater Crown Royal Private Stock Rookie Reserve there from 0102. There you go. Oh, Uncle Todd. Emerald Ice. Oh my gosh. Wait, what is that from? From Parker's there. Emerald. That kind of looks like a PMG little there. You got an Uncle. Oh, look at that. Uncle Todd. Pinnacle Summit there. Definitely some sort of parallel there. Because I have this card, but doesn't have that pattern to it. So, Uncle Todd there. Oh, 12 Storm. Uncle Todd there. Don't have that. Sizzling Scores. Uncle Todd with Patrick Waugh behind him there. Got a Bowman. Is that a gold parallel or just a base there of Uncle Todd there? Oh, got a Max Jones. So, some miscellaneous modern stuff here. Like Sapphire card there. I think that's what they're called. The 45 there. It might be a redemption. Actually, probably not. Definitely not. Got a Troy Terry. Rookie jersey from FB Game. Use the 499. Christian Vessel Linen. Clear cut young guns. That's interesting there. So there's Vessel Linen. Got an Aiden Hill. Young guns. On the Sharks now. So there's Hill. Oh, Jason Robertson. Red Rainbow rookie there from Allure. Alex Formanton. Just a premier jersey there. Rookie jersey. We got, oh, Kale Fleury young guns. So some miscellaneous newer stuff here. Then we get Joey Anderson. Artifacts rookie there. Oh, Tomas Hurdle. Oh, that's a true rookie right there. The 48 Hurdle there. So that's really nice there. Number two there, jersey. So that's a titanium true rookie. Very cool there. Actually, from titanium right yeah it's not from rookie anthology there's hurdle very cool there got a pk skills fabrics there from the 2018 all-star there for pk ufa we'll see what happens with pk this offseason ryan ellis contenders rookie auto there to 800 i don't think he has a future watch auto i don't think he does so he's on philly now philly not great this year but that's really nice there oh connor garland clear cut rookie auto there and the canucks now there and there's a cam neely from fleer 95 and there's a couple more cards here also jerry cheevers definitely past the playing days there for cheevers from zellers there masters of hockey and you got gordy howe there's no way that is actual autograph right like is that an actual autograph of gordy howe there there's no way right i don't know james might have to clarify what oh my gosh it is that is crazy and there's a one touch right there 35 point wow this card certifies that gordy howe's signature on the enclosed card is right here it's authentic and original this is one of 3500 limited edition cards not super limited edition but it's card 155 of 3500 gordy howe zeller's autograph card that is so awesome there's Silver Ink, Mr. Hockey. Ah, uh, do not have an autograph of Gordie Howe. It's been one I've been looking for there, but ah, uh, that is fantastic. Wow. Oh my gosh. Okay, we have a couple more T tins from James here. Just a ridiculous package. What do I even say? Unbelievable. Like, what the heck? I had to get this out. Hold on. All right. What the heck do we got going on here? Is this non hockey related? Just by looking at that there, perhaps. I'm just grabbing these at random. So, starting off here, got Garbage Pale Kids asking Robin. I will say, I am familiar with Garbage pale kids from way back when when i was a kid also but probably have some cards laying around somewhere but there's king size kevin the heck is this f14 flies in formation desert storm that's cool there i know there's some like baseball cards from back then that are quite sought after the desert storm ones but hey okay, it's very interesting there oh got some uh wwe legends mr t <laughs> nice that's cool there nice oh we got some tops chrome there nxt finn balor there not super familiar with wrestling i mean i have played some of the games but not any of the recent ones so you got Bushida there on card auto the 199 there okay you got alexa there chrome looks like just a base card and then you got tops here it's not chromed out or anything smackdown live you got a rookie card i guess of alexa bliss there oh you got mike bibby vancouver grizzly r.i.p to the vancouver grizzlies there but a tops rookie card blatant 90s there of mike bibby another grizzly card there you got Sharif there you got a couple of him there stadium club rookie there and oh you got 97 98 metal universe of sharif there as well very cool there Continuing on here, we got Vince Carter. Very oh, it's a rookie card too. That is sick. Tops rookie card of Vince Carter, 98.99. That is awesome right there. Love that right there. We got a Magic Johnson. What the heck is this? Commemorative series. That's a chromed out card. That's also late 90s. A uh, 2001. Very cool there. There's a Shaq. That's early Shaq. Perhaps his rookie there. 92, 93 was his rookie. That might be rookie Shaq. First or second year there. Oh wow, Kobe hairstyles. Early 2000s upper deck. Pretty sure there, right? Uh, 2000 there for Kobe. His rookie. He's like 96, 97, right? Michael Jordan. Do not have too many Michael Jordan cards. Obviously, he has a signing deal with Upper Deck and his likeness can't even be on Panini products. So there's Michael Jordan there. Very cool. 90s cards of him there. Upper Deck 92 there. Got some collector's choice of Jordan there as well. In your face of Jordan there. Two-time champion. Oh, that's probably a solid card there. Michael Jordan collector's choice baseball 94 there. Him on the White Sox there and him golfing. Yeah, that's cool there. Jose Bautista. Oh, that next card is so awesome. But uh, there you go. That's from Topps. Not sure what's that that is but 
2015. And yes, look at that. The bat flip chromed out. That is sick. Oh my gosh. That was a great moment right there. Refractor there. 2016 tops, I'd guess, right there. That is awesome. Got more baseball here. Ken there. Really foiled out card there. Got Jamie Allen Mariners. And the back's all messed up there, but 84 tops. You got Pat Borders there. You got Laz Diaz. Umpire card there. K. Umpire autograph. K. You got a Jose Bautista in the, what year is that? Like 87 or 88? The Barry Bonds year design right there. Like mini card there. K. Jose Bautista tops chrome there. Base. You got Kawasaki there. Interesting picture of him there. Obviously, James sent me a really nice Kawasaki quite a while ago at this point. But there you go. <laughs> There's a card of him there. Then you got Shohei Otani from Leaf there. There's that. There's Pete Alonso, future star rookie. Ichiro, like X Fractor there. That's cool there. You got more Ichiro as well. Japan's finest Otani and Ichiro. And then you got Topps Chrome Otani in the 52 design right there. The Mickey Mantle design, 52 Tops, first year Tops. Got a Mike Trout, Topps Heritage. That's cool there. 70s design. So there's that. You got Ken Sr., Craig, and Ken Jr. So the Griffies. Jay, Carlos Delgado, catcher for the Jays back in the 90s there. Larry Walker, Montreal Expos. Oh, Vladdy Jr., uh, Tops now to 49. Almost missed that. I'm sure there's a bunch of stuff I'm missing here, so I apologize for that. And again, hockey's number one for me. Trying to learn other sports, but uh, there's Fernando Tatis. I know he's good. There's a rookie of him. Tops paper. There goes Tatis. There's Vladdy Jr. rookie there. I know some are more desirable than the others. Like, oh, there's Bat facing down. Like, I don't know which one's the more desirable of the two there. There's a Tops. Is that Heritage, I'm guessing? It's like the OPG of Tops there. Or Vlad Guerrero Jr. there. Oh, Bo Bichette. And Vlad Guerrero Jr. there. Cool. Johnny Bench. Catcher for the Cincinnati Reds. That's the 25 there. Almost missed that. 2019 Tops there. Really cool there. And to finish off the 10, we have an Anna Kornikova. Leaf your authentic signature. 10 of 24 there. Gone card auto there. Pretty much like an ice grips there. So that is from like 2015 Leaf. Very interesting there. Alright, before we open the foul 10, I actually want to see what's in this big padded envelope. So let me get it open here. Oh, that's really cool. And I am absolutely running out of space, but look at this binder. Awesome binder. Special edition 9192, 75th anniversary. NHL binder. Got that silver finish. Really nice there. <laughs> the tradition continues. You got craft dinner and craft peanut bar. So let's see what's in here. We got a craft set here. So you got Lemieux, Recky, and Yager on the top there. Interesting set here. I don't know if I've ever seen these before. I am definitely running out of space. What the heck? But a few on the top left there. Messier there. Wow. Really cool set there. Oh, jeez. Eight card binder there. Who else we got here? Some great moments there. We got like Daryl Sittler there. So some very interesting cards in here. Jeez. Fairly large set. How many cards are in this set? I guess we'll find out soon here. Because we're almost at 50 cards in the set here. Yeah, there's 50 right there. And then there's a final handful here. We got McGillney there, Ray Bork, Gerard Gallant, Andy Moe, the old check, Thomas Sandstrom. And what the heck is this on the back here? The tradition continues. So, oh, we got like oversized pogs. What do you call these? I am absolutely running out of space here. Jeez. You got Gretzky and the Rocket right there. That's really cool. Oh, uh, look at that. Brett Hall, Guy Lafleur. You got Yari Curry, Bobby Clark, <laughs> Steve Eiserman, Jean Beliveau, Steve Larmer, Pat Stapleton, Luke Robitaille, Ted <laughs> Lindsay. And it just keeps on going here. Jeez. There's Patrick Wajak Plan. That's really cool there. I am aggressively running out of space here. There's more there. And there's another one there. What an awesome binder right there. Like, it's like padded too. That's really cool there. So there's a craft set there. Okay, final T10 from James here. I hope you know I could get the Elias Cup rainbow with the shields and everything and send it your way and that still wouldn't come close to matching the support you have shown me. Just absolutely unbelievable. So let's see what you have in store with the final one here. Okay, final one here. Oh, another one touch. Very useful. I'm definitely in need of these, so greatly appreciate that. But here are the final cards from James. I'm not sure what to expect here. And crap, I see the bottom card there. Wildly spoiled it. Dang it. Well, we got a Teddy Bluger. Marquee rookies. That's the white ice, right? The 99. Very nice there. Always looking to add to the platinum collection. I actually just landed a really nice platinum card. Posted on Patreon. But there's a Phil Gold Rainbow 1516 platinum, the 149. Speaking of Phil, ah, uh, look at that. Oh my gosh. Phil Kessel. Blue Cubes, the 65 there. 1415 first year platinum. Uh, Josh Hosang. I was looking for my seismic gold for the background for this video. It makes sense soon, but orange checkers. Yes, look at that. 5 of 25. Very nice there. Josh Hosang. Orange checkers. Very cool there. That's awesome. Got a Rudolph Balser. Rookie auto there. A Rem Pitlick. Red Rainbow auto there. So that's cool. Oh, Josh Hosang. Great White North. I don't think I have this. I'm pretty sure I don't. So very nice there. Obviously, I got the Connor McDavid, but there's Hosang. Very nice there. And then we got Blacks is Photography. Okay. Collector's Edition. Pole. We got Doug Gilmore, Mark Osborne, and Dave Anderchuk. I'm gonna have to pull one, aren't I? Okay, let's do it with Mark Osborne here. Pull. Uh, wait, I think you have to like pop it out, and I'm not gonna pop.
pop it out. But there you go. Mark Osborne, 7 of 24. So it must be like 24 card set there. Well, there is that. And then we got Todd Gill of the same variety there. The Blacks is Photography. Okay, interesting name there. Felix Potvin, Donner's Priority. I actually opened some of that way back when. We got a Mark Messier, also Donner's Priority. Direct Deposit there. Eddie Belfort, Donner's Elite. That's cool there. Die Cut, I didn't even notice that. It's like foiled out and die cut. Really cool there. Patrick Waugh, Donner's Elite there. Patrick Waugh Leaf Studio Series, 93, 94. It's like a script almost, like a super script almost. It's like rainbowed out there. We got a Felix Potvin Ice Kings. We got Wayne Gretzky Ice Kings. Really cool there. Oh, Ed Belfort. Home and Away. That's actually really cool there because he switched out his pads when he was at home and when he was on the road. So there's Eddie Belfort there. Oh, Home and Away. J.S. Jaguar there. Very cool also. Byron Defoe Between the Pipes. Martin there. Between the Pipes. Trevor Kidd. Nice. Love his pads there. Trevor Kidd Between the Pipe. Alex Ald. There's Trevor Kidd Invincible. Kirk McLean Invincible. Oh, what the heck is this? Oh, that is really cool there. Premier Quad. Topatar. Dustin Brown. Recently retired. 18 seasons. Great career there. Drew Doughty. Jonathan Quick. They got balanced in the first round in seven. The Edmonton Oilers. They were definitely ahead of schedule there. There's a core four. Uh, won the two cups there. Doughty was out during the playoffs, but that's a really cool card there. What year is that? 17-18 Premier. So that's a really nice one there. And then we got to finish off the package from James. It's almost going on an hour for me right now, but Mark Crawford Canucks card there. So what year is that? Uh, 82 OPG. There's Michelle. So we got some 80s cards. There's Rajan Lemelin there. Also 80s there. Mid 80s, right? 83 OPG. Richard Brodeur. Andy Moog. So there's Muse here. Mark Messier. Alt Coffee. Mark Messier. Ron Lowe. Wait, what year is this? Just to be sure. 82 OPG. So 82, 83. Paul Coffee there. It's not a rookie or anything, right? I don't think it is. Wayne Gretzky. So what year would that be? Year 4 Gretzky right there. Really nice there. We got a Gretzky 0809. Is that what that's from? I'm guessing. Yeah, 0809. I want to open some of that because the retros are really cooler. And it's a precursor to Platinum. If I could find a OPG. I think it's like one of the updates. I remember opening a bunch of that way back when. It had like refractors in it. Basically a precursor to Platinum there. Oh, Thomas Van Champs Mini Auto there. That's cool there. We got a Puck Personas Auto behind him there. Oh, Matt Zuccarello. 1617 Puck Persona. Cool little die cut autograph card from Platinum there. 1617 the box. I wanted to open recently but missed out. Got a Dylan Strom sign of the times and the final card here. 405 sign of the times. Ah, I don't think I have a Hashik auto. I know he has a fantastic auto but there you go. Dominic Hashik sign of the times. Questionable picture but still really cool there. Wow. Unbelievable package. I gotta do some sorting after this. Jeez. Yeah guys there is a package from James once again. Absolutely ridiculous. James. I cannot thank you enough. I definitely have to get all the Grant Fuhrer cards together and do like a collection video on that. But wow, unbelievable here. Some fantastic stuff. Just a tremendous variety of stuff there. So thank you so much. What else am I supposed to say? Your support is unbelievable and I'm forever grateful. This is just ridiculous. So. Yeah, guys, I gotta figure out something very special for James, don't I? I'm not sure what. Give me some ideas. I'm not gonna be able to match this, but I know I can figure out something nice for him. So unbelievable. And as always, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later.